purpose of the scholarship really was to reward those people that have invested in their own development. The day involves a quite a formal presentation where they've got to deliver in front of the chief exec of the PCA and a number of senior PDMs. Well, I'm currently doing a history degree through the Open University. Doing a degree isn't particularly cheap and winning the PCA Personal Scholarship Award would most certainly help in my financial obligations for my study. I've just completed my degree alongside my cricket and on top of that I started a company called Bubble Student which allows students to browse through all the student properties in the area, pick their best ones, to chat with their friends, share them on the app. The experience of doing the scholarship awards was invaluable. Coming in and having to present in front of a panel is essentially like a job interview, I think. It was a good experience. The positive thing is that some of those players who aren't able to come in person want to deliver their presentation over Skype. So it's great that they see this as something that they want to uh, uh, support. Personal development is absolutely crucial. It's so important to develop different identities in, in one's life to uh, promote happiness. I remember being a professional and always making excuses and not having the time to participate. But in truth, I didn't understand the value, which could have helped me further develop my cricket career and my future pathways. Personal development is absolutely key for not only your performance on the pitch, but also preparing for life post-cricket by giving you mental clarity, stability, and being able to step out of this completely immersive world that is county cricket. You don't lose any passion or drive. I'm still just as committed as I've ever been to achieving my cricketing goals. The motivation has to come from them. Having that plan for when cricket comes to an end could actually improve performance on the field, reduce some of the worry and anxiety that players feel having a two-year contract, three-year contract. You know, coming into that final year without a plan can be extremely nerve-wracking. Personal development is not all about after cricket, it's something that you can do during cricket to hopefully extend your career. Hopefully that'll be an encouragement for players to start now. So don't put it aside like I've done. We can all make time for the things we want to. Go out and embrace personal development. Yeah.